Okay everyone, good morning. Um, it's a lovely nice uh, Easter Monday this morning. Um, it's quite early, it's about uh, 7, um, 7.30 am, something like that. And I'm at the lovely Hillbark Hotel um, in Royden Park. Now, uh, why I'm here is because I've recently uh, been informed um, by one of my friends, Harry, uh, his uncle, um, informed me uh, recently that Hillbark Hotel was not always here was not actually built here um, it's a very old building originally um, I think in the 1800s but I will confirm all of the history in this video um, but it was originally built up on Bidston Hill and was named Bidston Court so it was then um, once it was uh, once it changed owners um, which again I will share all of the information I don't want to give away too much in the in the introduction video um, but it, it's once it, when it changed owners um, one of the owners um, did move it till, uh, to its current location in Royden Park. Um, so it's, it's a bit of fascinating history and, and some of the owners as well that I didn't, you know, I wasn't aware they, they actually own the building as well is really fascinating. So um, I want to do one of these little history videos this morning about the history of Hillbark Hotel, how it became um, to be in this location where it was first built. Um, I'm first located because I believe you can actually see some of the some of the structure still there and some of the outline of where it was built up on Bidston Hill. So we're going to take a good look at, um, at the building at Hillbark Hotel. But we're also going to jump over to um, Bidston Hill um, right now and see if we can see the outlines of, of where it was. Uh, let's take a look. I hope you enjoy this video, guys. Okay everyone, so I am now at, um, I'm on Viner Road South, which is at the top of Bidston Hill, and as you can see, um, it is the old uh, Bidston Court Gardens. Um, the gates are shut, but, but I have just pushed them, you can, can open them and go in to take a look. As you can see, some of the, some of the persons uh, graffitied the sign, which is great, isn't it? Um, you know, um, lovely bit of uh, Whittle heritage. Um, going back to the 1800s, so I think it was when I've looked, 1891, but like I say, I'll, I'll, I will share all the history um, in the in the video of it, so I'm going to take a look at, uh, at what we can see and if we can see the outline of this, of, of Bidston Court, which is now the Hillbark Hotel, um, so let's take a look.
Right, okay, so as I've turned that corner, you can see a um, real outline, like a wall. The shell of something. Um, see, like the, like an arched wall there. But obviously it's so difficult to tell what it was, because this would look like, kind of, as though this was the internal um, part of it, but, you know, who who knows who knows really it's so hard to tell there's a something that looks like what you, i was told you could see the fountain uh, maybe that used to be the fountain um but yeah it's so difficult to tell Right, okay, so I've walked further up the hill and come to um, Upton Road um, round the back, just continuing round from where I was. And I believe this is exactly, let me turn you around, I believe that this is exactly where um, Bidston Court was originally built. This is at the top of the hill and there's the, there's like the, the old, um, an old lodge, which is, as you can see, it's the, almost the exact same design as um, Hillbark now, you know, the same Victorian design. When I found, when I looked at old pictures as well, it's this driveway that looks um, looks exactly like what what it looked like back then. Um, I will have shared the picture, I'll share the picture with you. Um, so yeah, I'm pretty sure this is where Bidston Court was before it was moved. Right, okay everyone, so I'm, I'm back at this um, this arch shaped wall, this semicircle wall. Um, it does definitely look like an external wall, an old external wall for something. There's there's like cobbles um, on the floor too and maybe some sort of fountain structure there, but um, I've had a good walk around and I've had a I've done a little bit more research just whilst being here as well, but and it, it seems to be understood that this part that I'm standing here now was possibly the the outbuildings or old stables. Um, the the main house, um, the old Bidston Court, I think, and it is thought to have been up up there, further further up the hill. But obviously, there's there's newer built houses on there now, so it's not like I can go up and wander around there um, unfortunately it'd be nice if I could and there's some very nice houses up there too um, but yeah so this is thought to have been the old stables so what I'm going to do now is get the drone in the air and just have a look at the area around so I hope you enjoy
Okay, so there you go guys, that was um, the story and history um, of the lovely old Victoria building which is right in front of me there, uh, which is now known as Hillbark Hotel and located in Royden Park in Frank Beyond the Will. Um, so yeah, originally originally built in 1891 for uh, Robert William Hudson, who was a soap manufacturer apparently, um, as we the seen, and then owned by John Laird, who was uh, one of the founders of uh, Camel Laird Shipbuilders, and then um, moved in 1928 to 1931 when it was purchased by Sir Ernest Royden, as we found out in the video. Um, it's a great, it's a great bit of history, great bit of world history, in my opinion. I hope you, I hope you all agree, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, it's a lovely looking building, it really is. I have, I have had a look at this this building before now on some of my early YouTube videos, um, and my early drone flights because it is quite local to me. Um, but as I said at the beginning, I, I never knew that it was not originally built here and was originally built um, up on, up on the top of Bidston Hill. And, and originally called Bidston Court. Story I'd never knew, bit of history I never knew, um, and I was really pleased to find out. I don't know if it was, if it's, if it's really well known. That, to be honest, let me know, guys, in, in the comments if you would. Um, let me know, you know, if it's something that basically everybody knows and it was just me <laughs> that didn't. I'd be very interested. Um, but I don't think I'll turn you so you can just see as I'm walking away. Um, but yeah, I, I don't think. Lots of people do know that, uh, but hopefully you do now, and it's it's another bit of local history that I've been able to um, to bring to life a little bit um, once again. So thanks very much for watching. I hope you all did enjoy the video, and it's just another one of the 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 local history um, that you know, Wirral, Liverpool, North West history that that I try and cover. I've got quite a lot on my list that I try and get round. I get loads of suggestions as well. Really appreciate them. Anything anybody's got to suggest there. Anything you know, because obviously there's something like this. It was somebody that, that told me, like I said at the beginning, um, one of my friend Harry. Um, it was his. Let's walk over to the edge of this um, little bit. It was his uncle that told me um, over breakfast one morning. So as soon as I I heard the story, it was I just thought, God, that's something I've got to cover. So so yeah, it'd be great if um, any you know any any other suggestions of anything like that that any, anybody's got to share, please do. Really really like to hear it. Um, but other than that, yeah, that was a uh, Hillbark Hotel, previously known as Bidston Court, and the history of it being relocated. Um, the area I went up to see at Bidston, um, there you go, you can just see there. Lovely place, lovely place. The area up at Bidston, there's not much to see there. Um, and I did take a walk around, so you'd have seen in the video when I've when I've walked further up, where I, I believe, um, and the photos I've shared, I think, show this, I believe that it was located, it was originally um, built, the actual Bidston Court was on Upton Road, which is at the very top of Bidston Hill. And then where I was, where I started the video, where I'd gone down into Bidston Court Gardens, I think that was more like the, well, as it said, gardens, stables or outhouses or something like that. Um, because that that plot of land, I just don't think it could have fitted that massive building. Um, and yeah, when I've gone up to Upton Road and had a look round, you've seen there was like um, an old gatehouse, which is the exact same old Victorian design as that. So I'm, I'm pretty certain I've got the right places. Again, I am I'm not an expert. It's stuff that I I learn and pick up as I go along. Um, so if I've got any of it wrong at all, please do let me know. Um, I'm sure you will, but please share. Other than that, guys, I really hope you enjoyed the video. I really enjoyed making this one. Um, all, all local to me, so it was it was good to just get out and about and around the world. So, uh, yeah, take care, everyone. Please continue to like, share, subscribe. Loads more coming up. I'll be doing my giveaway. If you're waiting for that, my giveaway's coming this week. It might be tonight, but anyway, take care, everyone. Bye now.